I think you're touching on something there. The word stoic is often thrown around. And yeah. I was talking to Dr. Ryan Barton recently about the word stoic and how it's been very maligned. And if you look yes. back at the ancient stoics, you know, the Romans, they were all, they weren't really about just putting up with it and cramming everything down so you don't feel it. And I think the word stoic in some ways has been driven to be, oh, I'm stoic, it's fine, I can push through anything. Uh-huh. But that's, that really, you really see the impacts down the line of that. Um, tell me about your business. So you guys have a number of psychologists now, I believe. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to, can I talk a bit about stoicism? Oh, yeah, dive into stoicism. I absolutely love it. So it's great. So there's a, a really awesome book. Um, it's called The Ancient Art of Stoic Joy by William B. Irvine. And I really? love talking about stoicism because I think it is misinterpreted. Oh, sure. um, so you used to think about someone who was stoic who just was non-emotional. But new school understanding of stoicism is that the Stoics are actually really good with their emotions because they were so able to talk about things. Mm. And it was actually a big group of men initially who talked about Stoicism because uh, women kind of weren't allowed to, unfortunately. And what I say uh, to men and women is actually that the men probably went home and talked to their wives about it mm. and then they came back and then had the understanding from them. But for me, Stoicism isn't about that. It's not about being non-emotional. It's about having a better relationship with your emotions, which is actually then talking about them. Mm. Um, so I absolutely love stoic psychology. I think um, it can go pretty heavy. Um, mm. It can go very heavy around that, you know, we don't have much control over anything. Um, I think that we do have some level of control and we can predict the future is going to exist. Um, but heavy stoics tend to say that we actually don't have any control over much at all except for the present. So, um, but I love stoicism. I think it's a, a really cool thing. So 